Today we will talk about charging. How does it work? What does it require? And how easy is it in practice? We will ask a couple of questions to Martin. Welcome, Martin. Hello. Hi, Martin. Nice to have you. Thank you for having Please me. Take a seat. So, Martin, batteries. What is it that we need to know? Yes, there's a lot, but we will not cover everything in this episode. But what you need to know is the difference with, between the two types of batteries that we run. We run a lithium ion and we run a lead acid. Lithium ion is more like a smartphone. You plug it in whenever you can. And lead acid is more like a fuel tank. You go from empty to full. And talking about those two options, do you always need a service technician for the charging process? That's a great thing. You do, don't need that. Anyone that drives the truck can charge it as well. So we can charge it and it's easy as pie. I can, I can even show you. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. let's do that. So charging the machine is just as easy as unplugging the machine and plugging in the charger. It's that easy. It's that easy. So even though this is a lithium ion machine, it's just as easy for the lead acid batteries. So basically, it's for the customer to decide what fits best to the operational system. You're right, but we will, of course, help the customer choosing the right platform. Mm -hmm. For example, there's a lithium ion that runs for a shorter period of time where you can recharge whenever you're able, or if it's a lead acid, where you can run for an extended period of time, charge overnight, or using a battery exchange system. That's great to know. Thank you so much for sharing your insights today, Martin. Very appreciated. Thank you. And thank you for watching today's episode.